let us now look at a or analytics in today's digital world there is data everywhere everyone people organizations businesses institutions everybody is collecting some or other kind of data this is resulting in an information overload but the question to ask is this data which is being collected really useful is it helping anybody is it helping anybody make a better decision is it helping any business function get better at making decisions unfortunately the answer is no many times data is just being collected without it being analyzed for any specific purpose i believe that if any data is not being analyzed it is a worthless piece of data it's better not to collect such data if it's not going to be analyzed analytics is thus the conversion of data into insights insights that may be used for personal reasons insights for business needs at the end of the day your data has to make your business or personal life better i have a very simple analogy to explain the importance of analytics have you ever been to a sugarcane juice stall you must have seen that the person who gives you the juice has a machine the machine takes in sugarcane which is a long stick the sugarcane is pushed into the machine and what you get after the stick has passed through the machine is juice from the sugarcane and this is this juice that you are interested in same thing with analytics analytics is like a black box where the input to that black box is a set of data and what comes out of that black box is piece of insight your interest is in the piece of insight if the insight is not useful to you it doesn't matter what is the data that you are inputting into the black box the insights without which the data is thoroughly meaningless and useless so what constitutes the black box of analytics analytics makes extensive use of mathematics and statistics to convert raw data into meaningful insights it searches for patterns it does regression and it does many complex mathematical calculations to give you the insights so analytics is the process of applying mathematical models to data and converting them into insights for your business needs that's the real purpose of using analytics when we use the word analytics there is another term that goes hand in hand it's big data many people interchangeably use the words analytics and big data however there is a difference big data is not analytics and analytics is not big data big data is a term used for data sets that are so large or complex that traditional data processing applications are inadequate or inefficient the term big data seldom is used to reflect the size of the data set and is more often used to reflect the advanced methods that are used to extract value from data gartner has characterized big data with three v's v for velocity v for volume and v for variety now what do the three v's mean any data can be considered big data if the volume is large thus the sheer size of data is one of the attributes of big data what is the second attribute v for velocity every object or every system creates data at a different speed and this data is thrown to the big data system the big data system should be able to catch and hold on to this data whatever is the speed of the data that is being generated so that's the second v 
or velocity. The third V is the variety. Data is generated in different formats. Different elements, different objects, different systems generate data, some structured, some unstructured. And this variety is complex. So a good big data system satisfies all the three V's. V for variety, V for volume and V for velocity. Let us watch a video that highlights the increasing importance of analytics and big data in the world of tomorrow. Searching for a baseball glove in an old dark closet is nothing like finding a singing bird high up in a tree. Different objects, different environments, different methods. Likewise, at companies today, different types of information reside in so many different environments and are stored in so many different formats that quickly extracting meaning from what you have is becoming almost impossible. Today, information is flowing like mighty rivers from a trillion connected and intelligent things. And soon the amount of digital information will grow to 988 exabytes, equivalent to a stack of books from the sun to Pluto and back again. And with 80% of new data growth existing as unstructured content, from music files to 3D images to medical records to email keystrokes, the challenge is trying to pull it all together and make sense of it. But what if you could tap into this information to uncover lucrative business opportunities? What if you had the inside information you needed to retain customers or improve research? What if you could inject certainty and predictability into the decision-making process? Savvy organizations are asking these questions, and they're finding highly intelligent and profitable answers in clever analytics software that can organize, store, and mine all of the information scattered throughout their organization and provide customized intelligence to gain faster insight from this information. Every day, companies make bet-the-business decisions about their customers, competitors, new products, and even their own reputation based on account balances, delivery schedules, profit margins, and more. And most do it with cross fingers. That's because they know that decision-making today is an art based on incomplete and conflicting information, and that hunches play a big role in determining which way to go. Now imagine a company that could look at all of its information at once, spot hidden trends before they occur, predict outcomes in everything from weather forecasting to transportation scheduling to financial performance, keep its information safe and secure by providing access to the right people while keeping out the troublemakers and determine all of the different variations of a person's name. That's analytics. For example, in order for a company to attract and retain its best customers, it needs a precise portrait of who they are, their wants, their needs, their buying patterns. Analytics tools can paint that picture by analyzing and interpreting vast quantities of data, customer demographics, product purchase histories, internet experiences, and online transactions, turning information into insight and developing conclusive fact-based strategies to gain that competitive edge. The underlying technology works in three stages. First, advanced analytics algorithms using search and index technologies begin sifting through all of the different pieces of information for gems of intelligence. Second, the information is correlated and analyzed for patterns and trends at more than 200 times a second, faster than a hummingbird can flap its wings. And third, this advanced analysis is quickly turned into insight that is used to determine which actions drive optimal results. Recommended actions, along with supporting information, are delivered to the systems or people that can effectively implement them, rather than making gut decisions and hoping for the best. Imagine what this kind of new intelligence could do for retailers in terms of capturing and analyzing changes in markets, trends, and consumer preferences at holiday time. Imagine what it could do for doctors in terms of making better diagnosis and treatment decisions, developing new drugs, and predicting health issues before they happen by crunching data in days and weeks instead of months and years. Imagine what it could do for insurance companies 
In terms of seeing patterns in billions of claims and identifying the few that are fraudulent, and imagine what it could do for police departments in terms of correlating street-level information from myriad observations and devices to identify crime patterns and prevent them. As organizations are discovering, the best part of this technology is its limitless horizons. Breakthroughs are occurring virtually every day in our understanding of how to process all of the different kinds of data and turn it into not just organized information or even knowledge, but actual intelligence. What wasn't visible before is becoming visible for the first time, and this will change the conventional wisdom of business forever. And that's how it works.